What we're going to look at in this video is three different fabrics, Swiss Shield Naturel, Swiss Shield Ultima and Block Silver, and how the three fabrics perform in terms of shielding success against a modern Wi-Fi router that can operate both 2.4 gigahertz and 5.2 gigahertz. Uh, and for the purpose of the video, we're going to use the Safe and Sound Pro 2 monitor so you can see the actual reaction to the monitor uh, regarding the different frequencies on the 5G and 2.4G router. So here we have a Safe and Sound Pro 2 high frequency microwave monitor. We have that encased in one layer of Swiss Shield Naturel and we have a Wi-Fi router two and a quarter meters away emitting a signal at 2.4 gigahertz. The peak and maximum readings are the ones we're interested in. You can see that it's in the low to mid 20s for the, the recurring peak if you like and the maximum signal we've seen has been 44.6 megawatts um, per square meter and, and now we're going to add in the 5.2 gigahertz signal and see how we go with that. So the new signal is in as you can hear and the, the peak is moving around quite a bit. Uh, the maximum has gone up to 61. Um, with the same scenario, we have same sound Pro 2 wrapped with one layer of Swiss Shield Natural. Uh, now we just changed the, the 5.2 gigahertz signal and that's made a difference of about 50% poorer shielding capability if you like with the peak now being in the mid to late 30s and the max being at 61. So uh, Swiss Shield Natural struggling a little bit once we get to 5.2 gigahertz on the Wi-Fi monitor. So here we have the Swiss Shield Ultima uh, and as you can see we're doing okay the peak is hovering around the sort of uh, late teens early 20s and the maximum we've read is 35.6 so um, we'd like to see those two figures lower but let's see what happens to the Ultima's performance when we add in the 5.2 so now we've added in the uh, 5.2 gigahertz signal its performance is significantly worse than it was with just a 2.4 gigahertz as you can see it's gone up to a maximum of 44.6 and it's as opposed to being in the late teens and early 20s as it was with the 2.4 signal it's now in the uh, uh, mid 30s so uh, yeah not, not doing too well the Ultima against the 5.2 gig signal So here we are with the uh, monitor now wrapped in uh, one layer of block silver. You'll see a significant difference in the performance of the block silver and the other two fabrics. Uh, the first thing to, to probably comment on is how much more see-through the block silver is, which therefore means it'll also likely be more breathable. You can see that the uh, monitor is picking up almost nothing, not very much more than uh, with, uh, with the Wi-Fi turned off. I can assure you it's on. In fact, perhaps if I take the, the layer of the layer of block silver off, I just want everybody to know that this is genuine. There we are, just the one layer now. I'm going to come back over it. And um, it's quite stunning, isn't it, how much more effective that is against Wi-Fi than the Swiss Shield products. Of course the proof of the pudding is that's 2.4 gigahertz. Is it as good when it comes to the uh, 5 gigahertz signals? And here we can see that really nothing much has changed. It's uh, still no significant readings. Well, so you can see it doesn't even make it to uh, 1 microwatt and uh, for the peak and the max the same, less than a microwatt per square meter. That's, uh, I think you know, I'm even going to switch off the 5.2 so you can see that go away and you can see everything's nice and above board. Now the sound's gone, if I clear the max you'll see nothing much happen. Although, to be fair, you know the background radiation is not that far dissimilar, not too dissimilar from um, the monitor was reading when the Wi-Fi was fully active. Great performance.